All right, so there's simple things that sometimes I don't know the answer to off the top of my head. No! And I make, it a, I make it a brain drop. So the other day I was putting salt on my driveway, and I was like, I know this works, and but I don't know why exactly. Okay. So let's, let's figure it out. This is what it is. Rock on. Okay, so every uh, in most climates, unless you're in a vacuum or extreme situation, ice has a small layer of water on top of it, right? So it's going through the process of transitioning to more ice or it's melting. There's, there's gonna be an equilibrium in there. Okay. So there's a small layer of water on top of it. Uh, you drop the rock salt into that layer of water. Right. So it dissolves, you don't see it immediately, but it eventually dissolves and makes salty water. Now salty water has a lower freezing point right. than normal water. It, it varies on the concentration, but it can be all the way down to zero. So rather than 32, now this water won't freeze till zero. The result of that is now you have a layer of water sitting on top of this ice that is warmer than the ice. It starts to eat into it. That creates more water, keeps eating into it, creates more water, and eventually, if you put enough, the ice will it's be gone. More water. Uh, it's called freezing point depression. but one thing I thought was interesting is different formulations of it create better barriers. So the reason this works, the reason that it's harder to freeze this water is simply because you've got more molecules in the way so the, the water molecules can't solidify into ice. So you're essentially just putting little salt molecules in there that break down usually into two different uh, uh, molecules so that it can't solidify. So other substances would work as well but salt is the one we use for a variety of reasons, one being that it's easy to, to have around. Um, but the other thing to think about here is when there's not enough moisture, this doesn't work, which is why a lot of brine solutions are put down ahead oh. by road crews, because if they just drop salt on some of this ice, it wouldn't work because there wouldn't be enough water on Got it. Got it. So I learned something, and um, I'm always looking for the pet-friendly one. Right. And I, I don't know exactly what makes that pet-friendly, so that might be tomorrow's okay. rain drops. Okay, part B. Yeah, be, because that's what I would like to put down. But anyways, that's how it works, and hopefully we don't eat too much of it on Sunday. Gotta yes, protect Gracie's paws. I know, exactly. Yes. Precious paws. <laughs> All right, we're right back with New Center at 530.